Hey, look who's here, Jeremy Burge. Good to see you again, Jeremy. Good to see you, He too. showed up spontaneously on Sunday on Twit. There I am. And it was so I'm great back. to see you. You were in town for what? The Unicode Technical Committee meeting. It's what? The, uh, the quarterly meeting where we approve the new emoji list. So this is not the only job of the U Unicode Consortium, right? <laughs> right. They, they've been around for a long time. They standardize all text, all, all the characters. They're kind of the fundamentals of text right. on the computer. It's but, what was yeah. followed ASCII, right? Yeah, ASCII right. Was, 250, it was 125 characters or whatever, 128 characters. And yet people still manage to do ASCII art and ASCII it, it, some rather... But there's more than just yes. the Western <laughs> alphabet out there. There's many other alphabets. and So it was felt that if you have... how is it 16-bit, 32-bit? How long is the Unicode? 16-bit. 16-bit, um, so that yeah. means there's, what, 65,000? Yeah. Mm. And there's, is yeah. it signed or unsigned? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so there's either 32,000 or 65,000 different yeah. characters, which is enough for every language. And there's a little leftover for emojis. How many bit. emojis are there? It's a kind of a trick question because there's different ways of classifying them, but it's about 2,000. So there's 2, some glyphs, there's some weird looking things that well, aren't... You get, well, you get the new emojis that have your approve one code point, but then it has five different skin tones. Oh, I right. see. So that's two characters approved, but you get five or six different images. Now, for an old, for an old fart like myself, would the standard colon uh, bracket be considered an emoji? No. That's a right. happy face. Okay. <laughs> well, like, normally, I guess an emoticon, mm -hmm. in a way that it's, it's sort of actually by chance that emoji doesn't really have anything to do with the word emoticon. Right. It's just Japanese. It just happens to sound similar, so mm -hmm. it sort of caught on. When the Japanese created emoji, were they inspired by emoticon? They must have been. Right? Yeah, I mean, they must have been. happy faces. You know what? The original set from Japan only had about four faces. Oh. It. it was mostly oh, all okay. the... It was mostly... Food and, da and yeah, dancing food, and mm. fireworks. The, the and phases of the moon. Right. All the important stuff. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've expanded it now. In fact, uh, your committee went through all the... How many suggestions did you have? You get a lot of hundreds. suggestions come in. Yeah, I mean, there's hundreds, and some of them have maybe 50 in a proposal. There was someone that proposed 24 dinosaurs uh, in one proposal. You know, though. one's enough. <laughs> yeah, like, you can represent I just have this all image those. of you sitting there with a bottle of wine apiece, just like, okay, <laughs> no, that's rubbish. Oh, yeah, we can maybe do that now, one. Is there a separate emoji committee that does this, or is it the Unicode Consortium as a whole that does it? Or? Yeah, so Unicode has subcommittees for each topic. Otherwise, right. it would be crazy. The, right. Not everybody cares about emoji, so right. there's a emoji committee, and we parse through new proposals. And in then, fact, you told me there's people in the consortium who think that every, you know, emojis get too much attention. This is not all we do here. <laughs> right, right, right. And they get a hugely disproportionate amount of media attention. Sure. At, mm. at the meeting, to be honest, the majority of characters approved have nothing to do with emoji, but right. nobody cares. This is, <laughs> that, that's confess, what the it's first time we've ever had anybody at on at all from the Unicode folks. Mm, right. So you're right, this is all about emojis and for it's, us. Yeah, it's got to be. If, some, if someone approves a Tibetan character said people care about it, but not the rest of the people that don't care about that. They so how big is the committee? Uh, so the technical committee meeting is made up of Apple and Google and Microsoft oh. and Twitter, all the major tech companies. Okay. Everybody who does emoji. Yeah, everybody that does yeah. emoji and more. Anyone yeah. that does text. Uh, okay. Adobe is big on the... And the emo Go ahead. And some companies have actually built this into their inclusivity strategies, where it's like we've actively been supporting you know, multiracial, multi yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. having more women engineer emojis mm -hmm. and that sort of thing. Right. So, you know... I think Google was uh, the company that really wanted female yeah. uh, occupations. Right? right, that was a big press from Google. They mm -hmm. had a proposal yeah. in June of this year, and they said, look, we really want women to be better represented, especially jobs, jobs that women have in healthcare right. as well. And right science. on, um, right on. And yeah, so they sort of said, here's what we want. And, and so uh, there's discussion, yeah. right, in yeah. the committee. Uh, is it heated? You know what? The most heated discussions are about just really technical points about you know um, <laughs> it's which block in course. the code you know where which part of the code block it goes in and right. that sort of thing. The actual the rest of it there's already criteria that are set out to say it has to be distinct. It has to maybe fill a gap in the standard and prove that people will use it. So and, and be tasteful and as well. Uh, tasteful, yeah. multicultural too, right? Because yes. emojis are global. Right. So some of the emojis are so. Western, for instance, we were talking about the uh, the farmer emoji, right? Which is somebody with a straw hat and a carrot, <laughs> and that's an um, that's a Western farmer, right? Not an Asian farmer, right? Yeah, and and Unicode doesn't dictate what they look like. They kind of they put a sample image up, which can have some sway. In the end, it's up to a company. So if you were 
for instance, Samsung based in Asia, in Korea, you might make your farmer look completely different to uh, what Make a would. rice oh, farmer yeah, instead yeah. of a carrot. Unicode's farm. really strict about saying, we don't, you can make it look like what you want it to look like. This is what it's meant to be. Is there yeah. an emoji crisis? By which I mean, <laughs> okay. are we going to run, run out? Of, <laughs> are we going to run out of uh, of emoji? I mean, how you only have sixty five thousand possible. How much room for emojis? I is think we've got space. We've got space. Okay. But uh, the the real issue is on fonts and RAM on keyboards that mm. these images they're high res, and if you put the Apple emoji fonts over hundred meg now, and if it thinks what? hundred megabytes yeah. not a big deal, but on a phone in RAM all the what? time. That's a lot. Yeah, I yeah. mean they're high resolution images. So How many emojis are there now? Uh, the images on iOS, there's about 2,000 if you count all the skin tones. There's a lot. Yeah. And then yeah. you've just added 51 new ones. 51 new ones. So let's take a look. at These are the uh, just approved. This is hot off the emoji off. presses. Uh, by the way, got? thanks to Throwboy for these emoji pillows, yeah, cool, by the way. He does oh, no, such like a great job. Yes. <laughs> we left out the... Uh, now, I'm kind of impressed because I thought it was poo. But it turns out it's frozen it yogurt. It is not frozen yogurt. It is, <laughs> not, it is definitively poo. Well, uh, All right, you heard it here from the Emoji Master. He's, by absolutely. the way, Jeremy Burge is the founder of Emojipedia, so he's the chief emoji officer for us. So it's poo. In fact, they did address this yes. in this meeting. Brand new uh, document uh, updating the, the sample, the, the chart image to say this is how it should look. The old Unicode chart image had a poo with flies around it. That's out. We've got eyes. Eyes, no flies. <laughs> eyes, no flies. It's the slogan of this year's Emoji Consortium. I've got to All say, right. I, I do wonder if some of the people in, the, in these meetings are sitting there, I can't believe I studied computing yeah. for so long. 18 and now I'm years doing of computer science. I, I couldn't possibly comment whether anyone thinks that at all. <laughs> so show us some of the, uh, yeah, the new emojis. So new stuff. I, got. You know, from a purely cultural point of view, there's... Uh, a hijab, right? There yeah. is, um, which is the uh, uh, the uh, Muslim headdress. Mm -hmm. I think that's mm -hmm. great. Right. Um, and then there's a crazy guy with a beard. There's the bearded man. We've got the the milkshake emoji. Uh, that was Tanya <laughs> really <laughs> lobbying yeah. for uh, that the one. Big, but is it a milkshake? It could be a root beer float. It could be a diet Pepsi. We don't know. It's called Call the Boys straw. to the Yard. That's it's called <laughs> cup, <laughs> cup with Straw. Cup what is straw. the one to the right of Cup with Straw? I don't. That's weird looking. Th that is a breastfeeding person. There is no head in an attempt to it's, make it sort of gender inclusive, but it will probably get a female-ish looking head on there yeah. by the time it hits. I think it would help in the legibility because otherwise yeah. it looks like I don't know a blob. Right. Uh, noble goals sometimes don't result in uh, legible. Well, it's also kind of creepy to have a headless person <laughs> breastfeeding. Right. Well, unless you're around a guillotine, but yes. You know. <laughs> uh, I hear after your head's chopped off, you continue to breastfeed for several minutes. <laughs> Did you hear that? Um, there's the shh. But that, now you told me shh. That gesture isn't shh. Because it's culturally uh, well, it can mean different. It, we're not defining what you use it for. It's not called the sh face. It's called our face with index finger in front of mouth. In most cultures, <laughs> does that mean? It hush? generally means hush. Yeah. yeah. But, uh, but if you want to use it for anything else, there's no uh, Unicode's not prescriptive about how you use an emoji. It, just it could be up your nose side. with a rubber hose. It we don't be. know. It could yeah. be anything. Yeah. Uh, pie. People are fans of pie. They've got Love the savory pie. pies in Australia, where I'm from, or, or sweet pies Love over here. Pie. We have the pie floater. So you know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Flying saucer. Go. And I see a Dracula. Are we going to have some sci-fi? There's uh, a whole bunch of sci-fi. There's a mage, so that's a wizard or a witch. There's a, a mer person, <laughs> which is mermaid or merman. Uh, the vampire. Uh, I'm not sure if werewolf made it. There was a werewolf on a, <laughs> one of the fantasy <laughs> proposal so lists. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, dinosaurs, two dinosaurs. I know. I said, oh, you got two. I know Broccoli? I uh, okay. Is that a, a bowling ball side in half or a coconut? I'm that is sure. a coconut, okay. although those three dots are a bit suspicious, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> Sandwich? There's the two dinosaurs. You've got a raptor. Oh, you know, you need a meat eater and a vegetarian. Yeah. Pretty much. One of each, yeah. yeah. So it's a T Rex and a, what they call a sauropod. A sauropod. Whole class yeah. of, uh, oh, a me meditating young lady. A, a climber. Rock climber. climber. Yeah. Uh, now, why do the images look so different? This is. I mean, that rock climber is pretty primitive. Yeah, these are from the proposals, so it's still uh, up to vendors next year. They'll still make their own images. In fact, there's some controversy salt. over uh, iOS 10's emojis being too photorealistic. Yeah, big update. iOS 10.2. It's in beta at the moment, and... They look yeah, good, they look, I they think. Hyper-realistic, which yeah. is they look nice on a retina screen. The old ones were kind of blurry. Uh, they had Some of them had done, been done 10 years ago, which were on tiny screens, and they didn't zoom up very well. I think well, they look great. Some people are mad about it, though.
some what, people imagine. So speaking of mad, <laughs> what were the emojis that didn't get approved? Oh, this year, uh, what didn't get approved, there was one for leafy green, didn't get approved. Leafy, <laughs> leafy green, yeah, uh, I, I, I can guess. <laughs> California, <laughs> certain Californians would be very behind. Uh, that, was, that was more of oh, an Asian one, actually. There's a nauseated it. face now. It's a green one with yeah. kind of vomit yeah. coming yeah, out. Yeah, that got right? approved. Uh, Drooling that was face. On, this, oh. this is some of this year's list. This is an iOS 10. Oh, this is not the vomiting one. There's another one with vomit. Last year we approved the last set we approved <laughs> nauseated face this set has vomiting face so oh my a lot goodness. of people during the election results are very excited about vomiting <laughs> yeah. face coming around. there was uh let's see uh, what so, else so this is all this is the list that's been approved coming to 10.2 uh, okay month, so this, this is, is last iOS. year's list yeah yeah we've yeah. jumped over to ios now so right. this looks like right. fingers crossed to be very big on ios uh, face palm all from last year's list i you know what i think it's great to have more uh, just, you know, a variety of emojis. The problem is finding the emoji that's yes. right for you. What do you think, Ian? Uh, <laughs> big, big emoji I'm, user. I know, I know. I'm, I'm, I'm kind do of you, torn do because I would like to be terribly polite. No, I, over my <laughs> dead body. No, it just, I'm sorry. It's, I, I tried one on Twitter once because I was drunk and it just like. <laughs> just, what was it? What, which one did you use? It was the crying face <laughs> and it was just. They have a lot of distressed emojis. They're really yeah. nauseated and the vomiting. And now, now there's an emoji that's a like swearing emoji with a mm. bar and like expletives across yep. the. Yep. You can I'm, make a progression. I'm a writer. You, this is what you use you words know, for. If, <laughs> if God didn't want us to use words, he wouldn't have invented the English language. I, I'm saying that exactly. <laughs> No, I like but emoji. Yeah. I, I Sometimes a symbol is more well, expressive. Just, you know, I even feel guilty using an emoticon. I certainly would use it in an official email, but I mean, an emoji, I think I need to, I need to be you younger. You say twice as much in a tweet. I, yeah. will, I will argue that there's actually a very legitimate reason to have initially emoticons and now emojis, which is that a lot of times in the written word, nuance is lost. Yes. If you're being sarcastic, I can yes. hear in your tone sarcasm of voice. On, sarcasm on email doesn't come across. But it doesn't come across soul, in print. Well, yeah. So emojis are, uh, in a way, more expressive than language. They can tell somebody how you feel as you write this sentence. And so I think that th they, they have a real place in communication. I think, I, I think you're right. I just think I'm kind of behind the times <laughs> <laughs> on this one. I'm terribly sorry. What, uh, what are the, uh, are there any other emojis that you think we should, uh, we should point out that, uh, that are new for the mm. 51 is a lot. Wow. Yeah, 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 it is a lot. Um, personally, I like the stars on the eyes. I think that's a nice one to have. Hey there, uh, you with the, the stars in your sort of eyes. Like, wow. You know, the, to be yeah. honest, you said there's, there's way more frowny ones at the moment than yeah, happy ones. Yeah, let's get some happy get, emojis. You can get oh, look this. at that starry one. So I this like is that. Uh, so not all these got approved, but this is a, a proposal for a bunch of new faces, and a few of these got on the list. You can see the ex expletive up there, the swearing one. That yeah. one is on the list. That's ah, okay. Shocked face uh, with exploding head. I'm thinking that blown, did not yeah. get in. No, that is in. Oh that my God, in. mind that's blown. Yep, yep, yeah, yeah. So that's that's going <sighs> to be popular. Uh, and the number one, since we published the list, giraffe is still getting the giraffe. most Giraffe? Yeah, yeah. What do people use a giraffe emoji for? I'm, I'm a sorry. Bit, you know what, I'm really wondering what happened. There was another, in, inexplicably a year ago, a lot of people were saying they wanted a potato emoji, and it got approved, and no one really no uses, one uses it. it. Yeah. <laughs> and this is one thing that's great about Emojipedia, you can know which are the most popular, the which trend, one are used, yeah, they've true. got trending emojis. Yeah. Uh, for a while, uh, there was a emoji. There was an emoji site that was using Twitter Ooh. as input, and Twitter cut them off. Yeah. <laughs> I was very disappointed. They, they made it back, Emoji Tracker. Uh, it's emoji a great site, they back? got put uh, back okay. in, there it is, it's live on the air. Oh, they, good, because oh, so what is number one right now? On emoji, it's this is be, huh? when it goes green. Somebody's using that emoji yeah, on Twitter. That would be uh, it. Would be the the face with tears of joy. Actually, the one. one that's the least used is the one that always interests me. And it's usually, it's like the guy with the briefcase. What is the go to the very bottom? What's the least used emoji? Uh, I think it's uh, no bikes. No bikes. <laughs> no bikes. No, a you know lot what of... happened with the, the guy with the luggage? He was the least used. It's the right. blue guy holding the luggage. Yeah. But because he was the least used, became... a bunch of people said, we've got to use <laughs> right. this emoji more. Oh. It's so sad. This one is at the bottom of the list. So and now, there's one emoji that one that's, shot right up. <laughs> that's the strangest emoji ever. And I don't know if you've ever noticed it, but there's a guy in a coat. He's floating up into the air. Um, the oh, story is that comes from Wingdings. Yeah, Webdings, actually. Webdings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was uh, Microsoft's font. Yeah, there he is. Uh, yeah, it was the guy uh, who made Comic Sans. Right. And he was Making on the task hell. to make yeah. Webdings. Okay. And it was from an album of a cover that he liked. The specials, yeah, okay. the specials. Okay. Yeah. And he just thought this would be fun to put in. But then little did he know that Unicode were going to put the Webdings characters into Unicode. Oh. And then. 
we also said, hey, you know what? They're kind of emoji-like. Let's give them an emoji yeah. presentation. Oh, good grief. So he's uh, hopped all you, the way. This, I think this should be your signature. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm sorry. I've got no sympathy for him because he did actually create Comic Sans, for which I'd like to flame. <laughs> But, you know, it's just... <laughs> and he's wearing spats in that rendition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's this another is... thing to emphasize. You mentioned it, but, but there is kind of a, a description, a text description of an emoji. Mm. And then it's up to... You, you, emoji Consortium provides a, one design, but it's up to uh, companies. Twitter has a different emoji from Facebook, has a different emoji yeah. from Google, from Apple. So it's up to companies to make their emojis. Yeah. So, I mean, what's, what are the rules on things like, would there be a Trump emoji? Maybe next time you consider this? Oh, I mean, I do, do <laughs> individual people the, like There that? is a specific rule against yeah, living right. or dead people. There was nearly a Buddha a year ago when the synagogue was added, but then they went, actually, Buddha's kind of a lifelike <sighs> person. Yeah. So... Even though so Buddhism got represented by a wheel, there's a sort of okay. wheel that's Buddhist. okay. So, yeah, no real people, no Trump emoji, and uh, no no Muhammad emoji as well. I no Muhammad imagine. emoji. No, that would have been a logical extension yes, of any yes, of that. exactly. No yeah. Jesus emoji. You can have a cross, no Jesus. Oh, okay, you interesting. Can, yeah. So yeah. no yeah. no real people. It makes it, everyone's happy. It's a, it's a good rule. Everyone's I can't happy. Feeling. Yeah. yeah. Well, Jeremy Burge, thanks for your service on the Emoji Committee. <laughs> and you can find Jeremy, uh, he's the founder of Emojipedia, which is a site we've used for years to figure out what are they sending me? What does that mean? You'll find him uh, there as the Chief Emoji Officer. He's also at the Unicode Consortium. On the Emoji Committee, at Jeremy Burge on the Twitter. Do you use emojis in your tweets? You'd have to. I do, not as much as people expect. But, I, <laughs> <laughs> but it does add a bit of flair. I like it. It takes the edge off if you give a blunt reply. If somebody says, is this from here? And you say, yes, it sounds very rude. No. Put an emoji at the Was end. Was there any... Dis oh, there you are with uh, Jason Snell. Yeah, there's Jason Snell. He said to say hello to everybody. Is there any... Hello, when Apple decided to replace the gun with a squirt gun, was there any conversation over that at all? Uh, see, because that's a vendor decision, Unicode it's not, nothing, to, nothing do to do with it. it. Yeah, okay. Unicode. As far as Unicode's concerned, it's called a pistol. Yeah, and Apple could be a squirt design, pistol. They could make yeah. it look what the, what they want okay. to. That's not a Unicode discussion. So that sort of came out of nowhere. And to that's be honest, interesting. I mean, yeah, uh, Google has said they're not changing theirs. I spoke right. to Google the other day, and uh, they said not changing it. We mm -hmm. think that it's misleading. But maybe if everybody already had a well, that's the pistol, risk. Yeah. Then is, you, you is, weigh it up. As, is this a communication medium, if you have a pistol, a real pistol versus a squirt gun, let's say I send uh, you a text, Ian, that says, you know, let's Get have a pic, there, we're going to, to the park, you. bring your pistol, right. I I'm on Apple, so I think it's a squirt gun, you look at it, you're on Google, you're, well, I'm okay, if you think so, I'm yeah. now on a DHS watch list, great, yeah. Yeah. revolver right. So you can see yeah. it, though, I mean, it's a communication yeah. medium. Definitely. It's, yeah, I think Apple, uh, whatever you think about it, they've done a, a disservice to complicate things for their users, yeah. whether you want it to be a real gun Who? or not. Apple do <laughs> that? No, who'd have thought it? They're uh, only selling 17 dongles now, for goodness sake. <laughs> I love it. I'm, I, I think emojis are great, and they're great conversation starters, so thank you, Jeremy. Very well. Thanks it's for coming back up here. Great to be here. We dragged him back up. He was here on Sunday. <laughs> we made him come back.